Hello everybody, my name is Mitch. Welcome back to my single player Mitch Plays Minecraft, Mitchcraft World. And I'm just doing a little brewing here. No real reason. Pay no attention to this other stuff in my inventory. <laughs> so, what's new? What's new? What's been going on? Let's take a quick look outside. I'll show you some of the stuff I've been working on. I decided to expand this road going out this way. I've got the path kind of dug out. Still need to make it pretty. We'll go all the way around here. All the way back behind the farm over here. And over on this side, we might have to do a little terraforming to make the road work out. I'm not exactly sure. I don't know. We'll get there. But the road keeps going around this way. And then turns back around this way. Over by the mines. Just kind of gives us a little more area to build and kind of make this place feel a little more homey. Oh, I started working on a building over here too. We might get to work back on that a little bit later. But right now, I've got to get these potions brewed up. And I'm almost running out of food, too. It's not a good thing. <clears throat> Let's see. Okay. That's done. Now, if we add this in. Thought I'd make a couple of regeneration potions. No reason. No reason. Pay no attention to the wither skeleton skulls over here. So, yeah. Oh, lots of things have been going on. The UHC is done with officially now. I am sure about it this time, not like last episode. And my team won. Me and Al pulled the victory out, beating the gaming griffin. And I'm excited. It was my first UHC win out of the three that we've done. And I was just, I don't know, I'm super excited. It's like, yay, finally won one. After coming in like runner up the last two times around. That's only 130? Maybe it's glowstone that we had to use. Do I have any glowstone? Um do 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 do. Do have any in here? Yeah, we got some in here. It's been so long since I've brewed potions. Will that make it last longer? No, nope, that doesn't seem to be doing anything. I'm confused. But we'll, we'll just go with it. Give me that. Put that. Put that on the bar. Put that on the bar. Um. Yeah. So let's go down into the mines and see if we can't find a good place to fight this thing. Because I want a beacon around here too. Eventually the idea was to build a beacon around each one of my places. But since we're kind of still working on this one, I thought it'd be a good idea to go ahead and start up a beacon here so we can kind of grow it as we go along. Because I'm not sure if I've got all the blocks to make a full beacon on me. I'm going to head down here. Just find one of these paths where I've dug out quite a ways. Um, yeah, let's do it over here. I've done this before. It hasn't been too much trouble in the past. Of course, if we run into one of these caves, it might be a bad time. Well, let's just go ahead and dig it out like right about here. This looks good. Let's dig us out a little bit of a hole here and put it in. Um, might go down a little bit too. There. All right, so hopefully it doesn't get too hard to see. Stick that there. Give me the skulls. Put those there. Like so. And then we'll go bloop, bloop. And bloop. All right. Go ahead and drink this. And... Oh, he's making his way over that way to something. I never noticed the health bar is blue now. Or like a bluish purple. Kind of interesting. Oh, he found me. Uh, 
um, he's in melee mode now. Come on. Let's drink this. Got it. Let's see, what all did he open up here? Oh, he found a new cave for me. Good job, Wither. Anything else over here exciting? Tons of cobblestone. A little bit of lapis. All right. So we got the nether star. Let's, actually, let's do this. <clears throat> there we go. That way we can get back up here. We can get back around that way. Let's pick up all this cobblestone. And head back upstairs now, I think. Ooh. We'll explore that later. Alright, let's go. Head back this way. I've got some glass cooking. I think it's just obsidian and glass that I need to make one of these things. And then we're going to have to find a good place to set it up, too. Hmm. And I've still got one potion of regeneration. Let's head back up here. Is it night time? Dang it. I wouldn't mind finding a zombie villager, though. Because I've decided... I Well, I might decide on this. For every house that I build... I'm going to have to have a villager inside of it. Like, kind of personal challenge. I don't know. You let me know what you think in the comments. I think it might be a kind of cool thing to do around here. I've got one house almost ready. Alright. So let's grab this glass. Oh, still got two more to cook. Well, let's go ahead and grab it anyway. And then I've got obsidian in here. Then we go right there like this then doop 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 yep there we go we've got a beacon let's put some of this other stuff back up um, do I really have a place for cobblestone up here? I don't think so hmm well, let's toss some of it right there for now that's kind of the junk chest anyway. Put these glass bottles down here with the brewing stuff. Put that up. So where are we going to set this thing up at? I want to do it kind of like a medium, like middle area for where we're at right now. Kind of dig down and do it like as low as we can go. So that way we're sure to get the effect everywhere. But then again, we're going to need easy access to it as well. There's a lot of things to think about here. I think if we went like a little bit to the right here, straight down, that could be cool. And we could have fairly easy access to it if we need to. Let's get up there. Uh-oh. That's going to be way too much. Or maybe not. Here's how things look from up here. It's pretty cool. I like it. Let's see. Hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking like coming down like right here or so. We go like straight down right there. Might need to get some ladders and stuff. But for right now, we can just kind of stick this up here. Or do I want to? <laughs> that might make me a little nervous. Let's just do this for right now. We know that's where we're going to stick the beacon. Let's go ahead and get some work done on this house, though. Let's put the beacon away for the moment. <clears throat> Let's see. Well, first thing I want to do, kind of make it match up with the rest of the designs and things around here. So we need to take these corners out. Well, yeah, wait, that's in the good spot. Right there. 
Let's go straight up with that. Can I not reach that? Yeah, there we go. Got that one. We're going to replace these with bone blocks. It's been kind of my corner block for this area. There we go. And this one. You gotta be very careful because sandstone breaks fairly easily. And I don't know about the front here. Are we gonna do it in the front too? I guess we should. Alright, so do I have bone blocks in here? Let's just put the beacon up in here for right now. And I will never see it again, no. Let me come up the front here. And then take a look at that. That's already going to... Yeah, that helps out a lot already. Oh, we need to get that one little corner up here, too. Pop this one here in the corner. Get this one over here. I'm going to get this one over here. I'm not really worried about fall damage right now. And then we'll get right here. Whoa. Um, let's just go up all the way. If we need to, we can shave that away some on the inside. And then right there. Okay, now that we've got that kind of set in place, let's look at... I mean, we can kind of start carving some of this away if we need to. As you can see, on the inside, we've got wood. I need to do something about the floor, too. Hmm. Let's add that back there. And then we'll do like a mixture of sandstone and regular sand. Kind of like how we did in our house. We're going to kind of keep that same theme going. And the inside of this house is going to be kind of tiny. But I don't mind. It's still an interesting kind of look. Like that. And then doop, doop, doop. Floor done. See, that's the nice thing about this too. Is it's really easy to get this floor. This is going to have to go. Though. that put that there all right now let's go back and look at this over here how did we do the front I want to use sandstone stairs to kind of add those arcs in there and then we kind of have pillars going too and the one little lonely window there hmm Because I kind of want to stick with the same style, but we don't have to build it exactly the same, is my point. So we could take this out. Oops, too much. Give me that back. Um, put that there. Okay. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Let's see, we've got these and these to work with. If we wanted to, we could go something like that. I feel like that's a little too much. Then add one here and here. It's interesting. I don't hate it. This I'm not too sure about. Hmm. What if we use one of those other ones? The ones with like the creeper faces. Yeah. Put that there. That's interesting. That's going to be a corner. So we can't really stick a window or anything right there. Hmm. These double layered houses are kind of troublesome. We did like that. And then over here, we could take out like that. 
that much. I don't know. This is one of those things where I'm just going to have to sort of play with it for a while and see. We better eat. So I'm thinking about leaving like a one block kind of thing in the middle. Let's get up here. Like if we could go something like that. Take it one higher. And then put these like this. Am I going to be able to get this one? Let's just do like that. Okay, let's go one more. All right, let's take a step back and see how that looks. <clears throat> I don't mind that. I think that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's got a good feeling to it. And it has like the same kind of vibe. Hey, stop it. Go away. Hey, you're... Die already. Alright. But yeah, I like that. I like how that looks. We can add windows in there too if we needed to. Or at least one window. Well, no, because it's going to kind of be on the inside of this. Grr. Well, these people don't really need a lot of windows. I mean, it's sandy out here. If you have windows, you're going to have a sandstorm and you're going to get dirt in your house. Nobody wants dirt in their house. But I do like this. Hmm. Let's see. Let me come up one more with the bone. I don't have very many fences left. That's the problem. Let's bring this up over here. This up over here. And what if we just did like this across the front? Eh? Eh? See, it's like that one over here, but a little different. We don't have like the top on it. Should we do the top on it? I don't know. See, that's going to be our problem, using the same blocks, but trying to do different things out here. It's going to be a little bit troublesome, but you kind of see the process my brain goes through while we're working on this. Hmm. Let's see. I mean, we could do like a set of stairs, or not stairs, ladders on this side. So that kind of gives an easy way to get up right here. I don't know what we're going to do about this. Because I really don't want to use the birch wood as floors. Because we've kind of been using oak wood as floors up there. I don't know. Do not know. I mean, I guess we could. There's no rule saying that we can't. And let me show you. I mean, one of these is already kind of different. This is just a building I put there just for the sake of having something stick out there just in case you're wondering where that came from see like well let's go upstairs there here see we did something different right here so I guess we don't have to have it a certain way I mean if anything this is sandstone on top hmm Let's go back and look at this. I think we'll go with that. I think we'll just kind of keep it the birch. That's probably going to be the easiest thing on us anyway. Let's just turn them into slabs for right now. I feel like we're kind of getting the front facade done anyway. So we got this going up here. Then we could kind of do like that on the inside. I like that. 
Then over here we can put another ladder. And do the same thing up here. I'll lay across there. Add in these. Doop and a doop. Surround it with fences. And I think this side's done. Yeah, I think I'm pretty happy with that. That's got a good flow to it, I think. But you let me know in the comments. Let me know what you think. Hope you've enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. And I will see you guys again next time.